welcome to the shop. I always look forward to your visit. Get yourself something to drink and let's get started. Here's our next little project. Isn't that just a beautiful little ball peen hammer? To give you some idea of the size, it is, looks like two and five eighths of an inch long. And it's got a nice little painted handle. I think we'll clean that up a little bit and put another coat on it. But just look at the quality of steel, it's just, seems to be a really good quality tool that somebody used often and took good care of. Uh, it has van scratched in the side right there on both sides, so I'm hoping we can get that polished out of it. It says on here, Pascal. I am familiar with the Pascal the Philosopher, I didn't know Pascal was a company that made tools. But let's take this and clean it up. It'll be great. All right, you'll notice this has kind of been mushroomed out. I can feel it at least. I don't know how visible it is, so I want to take and taper that all the way around that edge before we put a nice fresh coat of paint on there. Here's our project all finished up. I am so happy with the way it turned out. As we showed before, this is a four ounce hammer. It's a Pascal brand. Like I said, I'd never heard of Pascal tools, but um, this here has turned out just wonderfully. One of the things that caught my attention right off, you know, if you've been with me for any length of time, I like octagonized handles. And this thing already had an octagonized handle. And the neck there is so delicate and small. And yet the hammer is just, you can tell it's a really good quality. You can see there's a little bit of shine there little bit of shine right there on the head. So both sides got the name that was in there all out of there. And it turns out very nice. As always, restoring these old tools is a lot of fun.
This one here, I don't have any history on it. I'm not sure about its history. All I can tell is that it's a very quality tool and it turned out great. So let's give it a home up here on the wall. Well, that was a lot of fun. I sure do appreciate you guys coming and spending your time here with me. I don't take it for granted as always. And I just enjoy sharing this with you and even having a cup of coffee or whatever it is that you're drinking. Have a great day and God bless. Thank you.